<laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Why would you ever do this, drunk or sober? I would never touch one of these. That but is one. never a good idea. Why would you do that? You know, I was gonna say I'd never be drunk enough for you to convince me that I would do this, but I've done worse. So maybe I would do this if I got a little too intoxicated. On a closer. Babe, that's not your shoes. <laughs> Whose shoes is it? <laughs> Oh shoes. no, girl, that is your purse. <laughs> Yo, she's, there's no way she's just on alcohol. Uh, there's no way you are that intoxicated that you're putting your foot in your purse and you're trying to zip it up like a shoe. Oh my God. I would pay, I would pay to see her try and walk like with this on her foot as her shoe. Oh, she's swerving. <gasps> nope, I <laughs> saw that coming. <laughs> I saw that coming. That girl was swerving like no tomorrow. Can you get DUI being on a bike drunk in the middle of the street? An e-bike. No, but they want to be treated like, bikers in Toronto are like, I am one with the road. Like they want to be treated like a car, so. If you're intoxicated and swerving everywhere, do you get a DUI? They have to get something. Drunk in public. Ooh. What's up guys? Thanks for coming back to Top 10 Central. I am your only host for this one. I am Joss Bedard. We are checking out some drunk girls caught on TikTok. If TikTok was around back in my partying days, I would probably be on this list. Oh, uh, uh, like my video. <laughs> I forgot. It really helps us out. Please. <laughs> I don't have a car. I'm walking. I'm drunk. Like, let me in. <laughs> Bro, I'm not gonna get over right here, like, hello. <laughs> like, hello, girl. I'm telling you, it doesn't work. It does not work. I have seen it firsthand, I've seen it firsthand. <laughs> right here, like, hello. Drunk people going up, walking up to drive throughs trying to get their food. It doesn't work. Just because you're drunk doesn't mean it works. Like, Do you think you might get in an Uber or car, girl? Just Uber eats it. Go home. Yeah, and Uber Eats. Don't go get an Uber, just go home and Uber Eats it. It's that easy. It was a good attempt. I've been there, I, I get it. Totally get it. I got it open. What's happening? Ah, oh my! <gasps> <laughs> My God, I did not expect that. Are you okay? She had to have broke something, like her back or a concussion. That is gonna hurt tomorrow. The hangover and your body is going to be in a substantial amount of pain. Oh, she was totally unfazed too. She was laughing. Ooh, you numb. You're so drunk, you're numb. You know, I've been there too. Where like, pain doesn't exist when you're this drunk. Tomorrow it does. <laughs> no. No. Keep walking! You keep walking! <laughs> oh my god. These are the type of people I want to party with. <laughs> These are my people. This girl looks like a blast and a half. I don't know how your foot is in there right now, you must be walking on your toes, like broken. Like you, broken toes in there. Oh, that cannot feel nice on your feet, but that is probably the best drunk footage I have seen in a long time. <gasps> oh! TikTok is a very dangerous thing for drunk people right now because the trends on TikTok are actually pretty crazy sometimes. So the fact that drunk girls want to try them when they're drunk like this one, not a good idea. And people can get hurt and they can face plant and break their teeth like this. Come over. Oh, hey Seth, what's up? <gasps> <laughs> this is a <laughs> Yes. <laughs> See?
see, I need friends like this, like those pranky types. This is genius. I will probably use this. I'm not kidding, I will definitely use this on the next time one of my friends is severely intoxicated. I'm gonna try this and I'll probably film it and put it on my TikTok. <laughs> I like it, it's genius. <laughs> oh, she can't even say <laughs> Oh. oh my god, oh. what I used to do. <laughs> classic. That is a very classic move for um, us ladies. The theory that you can just drink water and like magically sober up. Can't tell you the amount of times I've tried to do that. There was one time, true story, one of my friends would not be allowed into the club in, here in Toronto because she was too intoxicated. So they gave her a water bottle, like you have to drink this first. What do you think that's gonna do in 15 minutes? That doesn't do anything. It's a, it's a myth, it's what I'm trying to say. It might help your hangover the next day. It's more for the next day, but they're like, you have to drink this before entering. It's like, and showers? I've tried all of those. I'm equally as drunk. But it might help the hangovers, the thing. Take some Advil before bed too. Thank you for like taking me home. Of course. Did you give me the wrong key? No, Kevin, Kevin, that's my key. <laughs> That's not the right key. This, this is the key. That's not the right key. This is <gasps> my house. No, I swear to God, this is my house, right? I swear to you God. That? Oh, this is not my house. This is not my house. Oh. <laughs> that guy, oh, he is so regretting this decision to go home with this girl. He's like, oh my God. You were trying to get into the wrong house? What if this person was home? They were gonna call the cops thinking you're trying to break in. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. I've been very drunk, but I've uh, I've always recognized my home. That's that's good. I'm proud of myself for that. Well, you might have forgotten the time. And maybe I just forgot the time that I didn't. <laughs> True, but I feel like no matter how drunk you are, I feel like home is just like that one thing that's a, you do remember. <laughs> Not much else, but my home, I do. <laughs> What? Whoa. Yes, yes, Whoa. Yes, yes. <laughs> What's happening? I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> is this a puddle? Or is this a pool? Oh, a pool cover and there's water on it. My, okay, I was so confused. Like my drunk mom thought she could walk. <laughs> she thought she could walk on water, but I'm like, is this a giant puddle? Like, how is it moving like that? Oh, mom! <laughs> the fact that this is mom. Oh man, I wish I could get my mom this drunk. Please wait until the end. Okay. Oh yes, the slow climb. Come on. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. You can do it. Almost there. Come on. No. Oh. She's at the bottom, isn't she? She fell all the way back down, didn't she? She had to, oh. Like, I just wish I was there so I could just just give her a boost, you know? That's all she needed. She just needed a little bit of back support. Give her a little boost. She'll almost there. <sighs> I've been here though. Always climb up the stairs. Never walk, crawl. Because the impact when you fall is a lot less. I've learned a lot in this video today. And I've given out a lot of tips for your hangover. You're welcome. All right guys, those are some drunk rope fails caught on TikTok. Make sure you guys leave a like. I'm getting out of here though. I was your host Joss. I will see you next time. Thank God TikTok was not around during my time of partying because I probably would have ended up on there a few times. <laughs> this makes me want to party again like I used to. I miss those days. Sometimes. Not the hangovers. This is why I was glad TikTok was not around. <sighs> would have been some serious business back in my day. You know, I wasn't gonna say I'd never be drunk enough for you to convince me that I would do this, but I've done worse. You know, I've been there too, where like, pain doesn't exist. Can't tell you the amount of times I've tried to do that. I've been here though. I'm making myself sound like a wild beast, but I just party, you know? Like, 
Nothing crazy. 